Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. And if you're new here, my name's Janessa and I make videos on cleaning, organization, and lifestyle. In today's video, I'm gonna be taking you around and showing you how I organize my room and also declutter so many things because my boyfriend and I recently rearranged our room and we got rid of a piece of furniture that was right behind here and we replaced it with a desk because it'll be perfect for me during the school year because I am a senior in nursing school and I have lots of homework and studying to do. And it's also perfect for my boyfriend because he loves to draw, he loves anything artistic so he can do his artwork on the desk. I have lots of things to organize and declutter. We moved the bed and like I said we moved the piece of furniture and replaced it with this desk. So I had so many things in that piece of furniture and I also had clothes in there. So I went through all those clothes and organized them. So stay tuned for this video and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you're wondering where we got our desk, we got it at Target and we got this cute little Frenchie lamp at Target because I love Frenchies and Corgis so that is perfect. And this is a big mess. This is everything that came out of that piece of furniture. As you can tell, I have tons of things to organize and declutter. The piece of furniture was kind of where we just threw everything that didn't fit so yeah, as you can tell, it is a ton of things. Welcome to my messy room. This is the new setup for now, but I just wanted to show you how extremely cluttered my room was and how we kind of just threw everything anywhere it would fit for now before I started to declutter. The bed is now in the corner and I have to clean out that side table because I have things thrown in there as well and my boyfriend's side table needs to be cleaned out and cleaned on the top and my boyfriend is at the desk right now but that is our desk. All of these things next to us need to be put somewhere else. I'm first starting out by putting the laundry in the washing machine. We had a ton of laundry. I'm using the Downy Unstoppables and the Arm & Hammer Odor Blasters OxyClean Laundry Detergent. And I love the Downy Unstoppables. It just adds a great scent to our clothes. So I always throw those in first. And I am not using any gain pods here because they stick to clothes. I only use those for towels. I am throwing everything in in one load. I don't really separate whites unless I have white pants. And this is my life hack for laundry. I set a timer on my watch so I don't forget to switch loads. And I did not show myself putting the laundry in the dryer but they are all dried and I'm just folding it. Now I have so many clothes to fold, so I just sped this up. And like I said earlier, I don't separate my lights unless I have a white pair of shorts, pants, or a shirt, then I will separate it. But other than that, I throw everything in together even towels. I got used to this when I lived at college because if you have ever lived in a dorm, you know how tough it is to get a washing machine, especially if you have multiple loads. So when I lived at school, I just threw everything in together so I could do one load and that's it.
And now I'm organizing my side table. I'm starting by taking everything out. And in here I have some important documents from our works. And I also have just some random things thrown in here that didn't fit anywhere else. I have some school books that I need to keep and also I need to sell because I'm not going to use them again. So I'm just taking everything out and going through it all and seeing what I can keep and what I can toss and I'm separating everything into two piles, keep and toss. That way I know the difference and I don't get it mixed up. Like I said before, I have a lot of random things in here. A lot of it is school related, a lot of pens and some books that can be sold and I also have some things from my boyfriend, some of his games, so those can be put downstairs with his other games. So I'm just going through these and figuring out what I can keep and get rid of. putting all the trash in a white trash bag and I'm putting everything that I can keep in this reusable bag that is such a cute pug and that way I know the difference and I can figure out a place for everything that I'm keeping and I don't get it confused with things that I'm tossing. I'm starting piece by piece and I brought the two clear containers that were in that piece of furniture. I'm going through everything and also seeing what I can keep and what I can get rid of and what can be put somewhere else. I found my old iPod Nano and that brought back so many memories and it only worked when it was plugged in. Unfortunately, it did not work when it wasn't plugged in because I would have enjoyed listening to all the old music that was on there. I also found a Jonas Brothers CD and like I said in my last video, I was a huge fan of the Jonas Brothers back in the day, and I still am low-key. When I was younger, I wanted to collect quarters from each state, so I had that when I was young, but now I'm just throwing all those quarters in our change jar, and we like to save change because it does add up, and we actually saved a lot of change for our vacation to Bermuda, and we had enough to use it for spending money. So yeah, another life hack is to save your change because it does add up. And here I'm just trying to figure out the best fit for this clear container. 
I tried the big container earlier but it didn't fit so I wanted to use the little one because it does organize a lot of things so I found the perfect fit for that and I'm throwing things in the other container that need to be organized somewhere else. I'm organizing our snacks we have so many of them and they just pile up so I'm getting rid of the ones that are old and organizing the ones that we eat now the pink stripe boxes that are in our little snack box are from Bermuda they are fudge and it is part of the Bermuda fudge company they are at the Royal Naval Dockyard so if you're ever in Bermuda I totally recommend you buy their fudge it is so good and I could just eat it all. I wanted to eat it all when I bought it, but I knew I wanted to take some home. And I totally recommend them and I will link them down below. As you can tell from this part of the video, I was so confused on how to organize this side table and how to make things fit all together. And it took a couple tries, but I got it. organizing our vitamins that we take and I'm super into herbal remedies so I like to research about those found the perfect way to organize my side table so this is the final product moving on to my clothes I'm just separating these into two piles of what I want to keep and what I want to donate I'm not getting super into folding them because that will be done later so I'm just separating these into two piles for now same thing here separating everything into two piles I'm putting all the clothes that I'm donating into this reusable bag and now I'm putting all of my winter clothes in this drawer and it will go downstairs in that piece of furniture and when it comes to winter I will switch everything out with my summer clothes. Moving on, I'm organizing this drawer. I'm taking out my boyfriend's polos because he doesn't really wear these often, so they don't really need to be in here. And I wanted to make this drawer my summer bottoms and my workout clothes. So I'm just organizing all of these and folding them and putting them in the proper way 
and not everything just shoved in there and then I'm putting my workout clothes in there as well as some skirts and summer shorts. This is the final product and it has been working great for me. Now I'm in our computer slash guest room and I have a lot of my clothes in this closet because everything does not fit in my room between my boyfriend and I. So I'm just putting his polos in here because like I said, he doesn't wear these often because at his previous job he had to wear polos and now he doesn't. So these just don't need to be in the room. The three drawers on the right side are full of my clothes, so I'm decluttering this as well and taking out what I want to keep and what I want to get rid of. And I also have a lot of winter clothes in here that can be put in that drawer that's going downstairs, so that is what I'm doing here. I'm taking the clothes that I organized in my room and I'm folding these and putting it into this drawer in here. This just consists of t-shirts and tank tops. I'm putting some random things in my bathroom closet. Like I said in my previous video, I seriously need to organize this closet because it is a mess. Now I'm downstairs and this is the piece of furniture that was in my room. As you can tell, it needs to be organized down here because it is a mess. This desk needs to be organized and that is a dollhouse that I've had since I was a child and I do not want to get rid of it right now. We're bringing everything downstairs that needs to be put away. It's time to organize this and put everything away and as you can tell from the upcoming clips I had a tough time figuring out how I wanted to organize this specifically so stay tuned it takes me a few tries. container fits perfectly in here and I'm just putting some of my boyfriend's games in here and I'm putting our important work documents in here as well. Now I'm on 
on to organizing this desk and putting away the things that were upstairs. And if you were wondering why I got another desk in my room, it's because sound travels down here and it's very distracting when I'm trying to do homework and study to hear other conversations in the TV. And if my grandmother has company, it gets distracting and I don't want to be unfair to her. So that is why I have the desk in my room. It'll be a little more quiet and less distracting for me. As you can tell, I have a lot of nursing school books and nursing school things, so I'm trying to combine everything into this little clear container. And now on the sticky note, I'm writing that it's my winter clothes in the top drawer so people don't get confused. And this box needs to be thrown away. And I'm taking the trash out and getting everything all organized. So this is the final product of my desk down here. These are just documents from the few last semesters with my study guides and this dollhouse like I said is important to me so I'm not getting rid of that right now. I'm back in my room and I'm taking this little container and putting my boyfriend's magic cards in here. He has a ton of magic cards and I put some in baggies so that they don't get destroyed and this container is perfect because everything fits in here and it's all in one spot. This is the final product. Now I'm taking this little cookie container and this little dish. It's not ideal but it works for now and I'm organizing my side table with all of my things that I need on here, lotion, perfume, deodorant, and the little container is being used for my jewelry. Moving on to my boyfriend's side table, I'm just organizing everything and I was struggling with Spider-Man over here to get him on his little holder and he fell over a couple of times. But I'm organizing everything and then I'm cleaning it with the Windex. Organizing this closet and throwing things away that really don't need to be in here and I'm condensing everything so it all fits so I can put some other things in here. Coming up, I'm putting our foot massager in here in this container with plant things and we have Pac-Man frogs so his food's in there. I'm moving this to the other side. I want to find a better table to display my boyfriend's chessboard, but we're just using this for now and I'm putting my paintings under here. Finally, I'm putting our Yogibo where it fits perfect. This is the final product. Everything is so much more organized and I'm glad I decluttered everything. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you can see more content from me and leave a comment telling me which video you would like to see next. I have a whole list of videos that I'm planning to make, but just let me know your recommendations.